Hello guys, welcome to the video. My name is Crypt, and as you guys know, Logitech just recently announced a new update. All right. So today I'm going to teach you guys how to create a new profile based on this new update. All right. So first thing you're going to do is you're going to go over here to the top. You're going to click on active profile. Okay. And over here, you're going to see all your profiles. Okay. And your games and applications. All right. So games applications at the top and profiles in the bottom. These didn't change. Okay. And over here, we're going to go to the desktop. Game application, it's already selected for us. On profiles, you're gonna go on default. You're gonna click here on this little icon saying scripting. Click here. And then from here, as you guys know, there's already a big difference, all right? We have this screen over here, and on the top left, we have the name of the profile, and over here, we have active Lua scripts, okay? If you have an active Lua script, you can come over here and select it, okay? But in this case, I'm gonna create a new one. So create new Lua script. You can also do it right here through this blue button at the bottom saying create a new Lua script, all right? So I'm gonna click on it. And over here, we already have the new Lua script, okay? So as you can see here, we already have a function. I already taught you guys how to use this function over here, okay? We have an output log message, okay? And we have an end, okay? So as you guys can see, nothing's happening right now because this function is actually um, commented out, okay? So I'm gonna uncomment it, and I'm gonna press Control S, and I can press any key in my mouse right now it's gonna show up as you can see i'm pressing some keys in my mouse i have the g502 and i'm pressing keys in that mouse and right now i'm gonna press some keys on my keyboard and as you can see everything is working properly all right so that's pretty much it that's how you can create a script now i'm gonna teach you guys how to import scripts so nothing changed you're gonna go back to my website right here all right this is my website you're gonna go to the member page okay and you're gonna have to sign in to my website okay signing is very simple just put your email and your password and that's it over here we have a few apps okay i'm gonna download simple recoil as you can see it's for the logitech app simple recoil right here okay i'm gonna click on download the big download button right here it's gonna download it okay it's gonna download it as a zip file you're gonna have to extract it okay so i'm gonna extract it real quick all right guys so as you guys can see i already extracted it and i have it on my desktop so all i'm gonna do over here is i'm gonna click on script on the top left i'm gonna go import and i'm gonna import it from my desktop okay so i'm just gonna come over here real quick I'm going to import it from my desktop. Okay, so I'm gonna. As you guys can see, I have the script right here. Everything is working. I can press non lock right here. I'm gonna activate my non lock key. I'm gonna press my aim button right here. And I'm gonna press left click. All right. So I'm gonna save it. And there you go. All right. Now it's working. Okay. And that's pretty much it. So now all we gotta do now is we're gonna need to make sure that we are actually saving this as something we wanna save it. So on the top right, you have something called new scripts and you have a little pencil or pen um, icon right here. You're going to click on it and you're going to name this something else. So I'm going to name it simple recoil scripts. And I'm going to put a description, um, press non-lock, no, actually non-lock needs to be on, press aim button and um, shoot button. All right. And there you go, I'm gonna click save, and now it's working properly, and I can exit out on the left over here. There you go, guys, that's how you do it, all right? Don't forget to subscribe and like this video.